Hi everybody, today I'm going to be doing a review for a mini home theater projector made by Luby. Or is it Lubby? I'm not sure how to pronounce it, but it's spelled L-U-B-Y. Out of the box, you get the mini home theater projector, lens cap, audio video signal cable, remote control, batteries are not included, HDMI cable, power adapter, manual, and a portable screen. The size of the screen is 56 inches by 32 inches. Okay, the inputs on the projector are VGA, USB, HDMI, SD, and audio and video. With the audio video cable that comes with the unit, this allows you to connect some of the older technology devices such as a laser display, DVD player, VCR, and even some of the old gaming systems, like let's say the PlayStation. And it goes into this input here. So that's the audio and video connection input. Now with the VGA input, this allows you to connect a laptop or a computer to the projector. But according to the instructions, if you do that, you need to downgrade the signal from your laptop or computer to 800 by 600 or 1024 by 768. Now this is a little confusing because one of the inputs is HDMI which is capable of 1080p as an input. So I'm not sure why it's limiting you to 800 by 600 or 1024 by 768 input. Does it really output 1080p? We'll get to that in a moment. So now I connected my HDMI input to the projector and I'm able to view the 1080p signal. Now the projector also comes with speakers in the back of the unit so that you can hear the sound and I can actually control the volume from the remote control. Now let's talk about the menu system. I like the menu system because you can access it from either the remote control or the top of the unit. You can cycle through the various picture modes, the sound, and also set the time on the unit. Overall, I find this product to be very useful. It's very portable, lightweight, and I like the many different features of it. Some of the things that I didn't like about the unit was the fact that there is no zoom function on it. The only controls you have for image is really the keystone and also the focus, which to me it's okay but in actuality if you want to control the size of the picture you have to actually move the projector either further away from the screen or closer I also like the fact that you have speakers on the back of the unit two of them here so you have stereo sound now if you don't want to rely on this and you have a better speaker system or an external speaker you can connect it to the port here and actually control the volume from your remote control even mute the signal if you need to so overall I think this is a flexible little projector one that I definitely will add to my backyard movie arsenal and uh, I hope uh, you found this review helpful and thank you very much for listening and see you next time. Bye.